We Okay, so meet you back in the uh the big cave. Okay. That we started tonight in. Because I think that's where we're going. Oh come on. I am uh, being assailed by every creature in this cavern. Yeah, that that cave sucks. I don't I don't like that cave. It's just filled with a lot of little mean things. I'm not getting any more pings. It's really nice to actually be able to grab everything. I wonder how many more, like, utility upgrades we even have in this game. Probably not a whole lot. Yeah, I, I think there is an alloy down here that I... I don't want to go back to, down there. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I'm seeing tons of alloys. I just can't determine if any of them, them are in this cave or if I need to keep going up. Because I see I one that's a 137 that's close to where you are. Yeah, I see that, but I can't get to that. That's a... There's got to be another entrance to get to that one. One way or another, I think you do want to come down here. I don't think there's anything else up above. Really? Because I'm seeing something that's only 29 meters above me that's alloy-based. And that one is a slime. Really? Yep. Oh. Okay, then what area do we want to go to next? Big cave. Oh, I just don't want to go back through this cavern. Go fat, fast, most things won't bother you. Yeah, Is there a way the to get one... through the cavern? Uh... Through this cavern? Yeah, yeah. It's where the eyeball jerks. Okay, I got it. Oh, hey, here's another jump spot. I don't believe we actually got to. Oh, hey, Wait, really? Is, it, is this not enough? Oh, maybe we can't. Wander, do you get up here? Where are you? Out uh, in the main cavern. Coming. I see a jump pad. Did you put that there? Yeah, I did that. I've already been all the way up there. There was fuel. Oh, okay. Yeah, sorry. Well, now that we have the grappling, maybe we can go up to the far right, right? Yeah. Still don't think or we can do anything with off? this. Yeah. So the one, the alloy that I'm looking at currently, I have no idea how to get to that one. Where is it? The one that's like kind of in the heart of this mountain. Right. It, when I was in the mountain, it was only 30 feet away. No, there's another one that's way higher. Well, let's go up onto the vines. Yeah, that's fair. Now that we have access to them. Let's see. It also keeps saying secret nearby, but I, I don't really know. Hmm. Yeah, you're right. Well, I think it might be from this. A lot of nice resources. resources. Here, here. 
Rob! Yum, 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 yum. Oh, we're bad at picking these up. Oh, hey, there's a secret spot down here. Hey. Oh, there's a glob. Did you jump up? Uh, I jumped places. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Yeah, I'm with you. Okay, so we have a spot over to the left. We have this spot right here. Ah. There we go. This is interesting. What? Oh, hey, hey, there's a treasure chest. Oh, did you keep going up? Yeah. Oh, and that's it looks up. Like, mm -hmm. And it looks like we have to do the same thing where we find the three glyphs. Okay. Should be easy enough. Now so, we can actually so there work is together a... for this one. There is an amber thing for this. So I don't know if one of the glyph spots is hiding beneath that. That might present an issue for us. Oh, shoot. Well, there's a glyph in here. However, I don't have any more... Oh, hey, I found a teleportation spot. Do you got any more bomb pods? Uh, I might. Yeah, because I know that there's one bomb spot down there. Yeah, because I actually haven't refilled. I'm a okay. Dance. <laughs> yeah. What? Okay. Oh, what's three of those creatures? Oh, did you just keep going up? Yep. I think I just read them all, though. Yeah, this leads to a teleportation spot. But yeah, I can go back down and use the bomb pod. Uh, or we could keep going up for a little while. Well, I don't really know how much further up there is. There's except, a boss. Except for this, right I mean, here. this is called this the, the like, layer of the matriarch. Oh my, so. what is that? It looks like the mother worm of that thing. Look! Oh! oh! It's that, it's, I have been, I hate its children. They're, it's the teleportation children. There's a lot of these bomb pods around here. Does that mean we throw this stuff in her eyes? Maybe, She's yeah. She's blinded. Oh, wait. There are various tongue things. Oh, yeah. There are these yellow pustules. Hit all the yellow pustules that are open. But you have you can only get a oh, yeah, clear got shot it. from certain spots. And it has tongues all over the place. Ugh. Gross. This is not the boss I was expecting up here. <laughs> but it is probably the boss that we deserve. <laughs> okay, she's pissed. Her eye eyeball is red. Hit it a couple times. So it looks like keep hitting the uh keep hitting those blobs as soon as you yeah. see them. Whoop. Wait, there's what? There's children? Did you see that? But they're fat ones. Maybe we should scan them. Sorry I killed that one without thinking. But did you see the secondary ones? There was one that was larger. If you see one of them, make sure to scan it. Okay. Might show up in the next next cycle. Next. 
Oh, the soundtrack for this is really good. I don't know. I, I'm finding myself actually rather liking kind of pseudo country music without the, uh, without the singing about trucks and women. Mm-hmm. Oh, I see it. Last one's down low. You got it. I have it. But we didn't get to scan the middle critter, did we? I'm sure we'll get another chance. It's probably going to summon more. Yeah, I think we have to hit her in the eye again. Yep. She's opened them. Got it. I think. Or do we just shoot the eye? Yeah, I think you just shoot it. Oh, I, I thought we were supposed to use the acid. Well. I haven't seen a, a middle-sized one. There was a mushroom that we hadn't scanned. That might have been oh, it. Nice. No, 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 no. There was definitely a medium-sized version of the little grubbins. Weird. Okay. Okay, got one of the nodules. Regular floop snoot. Okay. I cannot see the last I got one. it. Maybe it's around here. I got it. There we go. Uh. We had to hit her in the eye, probably. Probably. One last time. Got it. Oh. That'll teach it to be in our way. And it is dead. Oh, I see. Uh, we're just supposed to go down. Wait, down the hole? Yeah, there's like a hole at its at its base. Let me look. The caustic altar? Heck yeah. Well, my Stract game's suddenly wigging out. Extract and analyze. I was really, yeah, I was kind of expecting that thing to explode into a bunch of goop. Okay, uh, so Shell? Yeah? Uh, we have a teleporter? Yeah? To the enigmatic spire. Hopefully this Ooh. works. It didn't bug out earlier, so that's a good sign. So did we actually gain access to acid stuff? Yeah, yeah, we can get the up upgrade that gives us acid gloves. Okay, let's hope I don't get caught in limbo again. Nope, seem to have made it. The elevated realm. Ooh. This looks like the top of the tower. Yeah. Oh boy. I think we should both just take a moment here to reflect on how far we've come. Personally, I was certain you'd quickly die so many times that we'd run out of the goo we used to regenerate you. But you didn't. And I won't lie, I've come to enjoy our time together. Which is why it pains me to say that I am registering an enormous heat signature at the center of the tower. Enormous! I've redirected the cartographers to get some more info, but it's giving me the heebie-jeebies. I'll get back to you when I have more info. 
Well, I'm gonna head <laughs> back to the teleporter for a second. Only kidding. <laughs> no, I'm not kidding. You got some important new mail back at the javelin. Fungissimo. Let's see. What? It's time for more paperwork. <laughs> Hell yeah! More paperwork. Oh, I have to do more stuff at the javelin. Yep. You can craft an upgrade if you wanna. Okay, so fun with corrosives is done. So now we can do light bombs, and next up we gotta find the static plant. Oops, that's the wrong right one. because we still need to access all of those doorways. Hmm. Yeah, and the new report can only be read by you. Okay, so we've got to work on our science journal. Uh, let me see. Kill four stuck creatures in three seconds. Three amber puffer birds with a single bomb of granite. Two creatures with a dying prime jelly wafts acid. Hey, for messages, have we did have we read the introducing plague away? No, I don't think so. <laughs> All right. Introducing oh, one second. Wait. Oh, wait. Yeah, yeah. You can read that. Sorry. I've just got a new report that I have to go through in a second. All right. Introducing Plague Away from tomorrow's products today. Plague anxiety got you feeling down? T tearing your hair out, planning your day around unpredictable plague mists? Double, triple, even quadruple checking your home's plague filtering airlocks? Have no fear. Plague Away is here. By just taking one Plague Away tablet daily, you can reduce your chance of contracting the Black Death. Wait, what's going on? Nothing? What? An advertisement's going. Oh. At the TV. For well, burgers. You want to turn it off? I can't. I honestly can't hear anything. Because I'm in a I'm in the new report menu. Okay, I'll stop the video. Alright, so I'll go back to the plague plague message. By just taking one Plague Away tablet daily, you can reduce your chances of contracting the Black Death, the horrific medieval super disease long thought extinct, but resurrected with the thawing of the Arctic permafrost by up to 95%. That's right. Plague Relief is here at last. With Plague Away, you can rest easy, knowing that you and your family will have only the slimmest chance of erupting with pus-filled boils and dying in a pool of vomit, blood, and diarrhea. For more information, contact a qualified medical retailer today. Man, I have one of those really annoying voices if I really want to. Uh, what well, would you consider it? The annoying saleswoman for, what was it? Those television call-in orders? Oh, boy. Call 555-555 right now and blah, 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 blah can be yours today. Pretty much. What I are mean, you going over? I it's one of those reports. Hey. Oh, okay, what's back. in the report? Welcome back back explorer J seventy five X three two one. Yep, it's survey time again. You might honestly want to come in here for this, just so you can hear it. Oh. Oh. Okay. Just because otherwise we're effectively just leaving Shell out of this ex entire experience, which is, you know, it's okay. Man, I'm hungry again. I got a I have today. Toast? And pizza? Did I eat anything else before stream? Yeah, I don't know. I've been streaming for 12 hours. Woof. All right, mission report number two. Let's begin. Comparing you to other explorers we've got out in the galaxy, you are way better at discovering stuff. One of the best, actually. Feel free to ask Smoke to wait, staff. You've refueled the javelin just enough to reach the Earth. Unfortunately, you don't have enough to slow your approach. But technically, slamming into the Earth at 2,000 miles an hour 
technically counts as completing your mission. But if you want to be a wuss and survive, you'll have to collect more fuel. Amazing! Remember, completing your new science experiments will increase your rank, and increasing your rank will unlock all kinds of new tools. Hurrah for progress! Soon, you'll be returning to Earth, which means you can get a jump start on the best part of human existence. Shopping! What's the first thing you're going to buy on your return? Droids. Imagine never having to clean again. I don't want a mansion. What, would, what the hell would I do with the giant house? I Super just, yacht? I just want a house. Yeah, but I don't want a mansion. I would want like an underground cozy bunker. Droids. Fantastic. It costs double now. Wow. Screw you. Thank you for participating. Your data is of great personal and financial value to us. Your efforts have so far yielded much useful data. Not the least of which is the discovery of an entirely new alien civilization that our initial scans did not detect. Now that you have reached the top of the alien structure, we must press upon you the importance of discovering its purpose. Entry to the tower should be your primary focus. Alright, you want to go read some of these? Yeah. Yeah, I guess we got some new things. Because we got destroy your debt and in introducing plague away, you did plague away. Yeah, I already read the plague away. Definitely not destroy your debt today, though. No, 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 no. I know. I find it interesting that they're bringing up the whole melting of the polar ice caps, releasing diseases, long thought dead. Destroy your debt today. From Cortec Technologies. Have the challenges of daily life got you down? Are you one of the hundreds of millions of Earth citizens struggling under the weight of immense debt, desperately hoping for any chance to get some much needed financial relief? Corptech Technologies is here to help. By simply granting Corptech Technologies, a proud member of the Globoverse family, corporations, and financial subsidiaries, full legal ownership of your of your brain. Legal, sorry full legal ownership of your brain? Ew. You can instantly slash your existing debt in half. With this risk-free agreement, Corp Tech Technologies will generously grant you the continued use of your brain for the rest of your life until a medical professional has conclusively pronounced you dead. So, what are you waiting for? Reply to this email and a representative will be in touch. Disclaimer, the medical professional chosen to determine your death will be assigned at the discretion of Medicor, a proud member of Globoverse family of corporations and financial subsidiaries. You'll agree to confer all film and television rights related to your thoughts, feelings, ideas, and dreams to Globofilm, a proud member of the Globoverse family of corporations. Wait, so... All of your hopes and your dreams are theirs to do with what they will. Wow. And what? <laughs> That's so shitty. And your death is pronounced by one of their employees. And yeah. Oh, well then. So, what does their television programming consist of? Heck, uh. No, no, I, I think it's, the point is, uh, if you come up with any idea, period, they can make a TV they, they and... Mm-hmm. Yeah. Precisely. That's how they're getting their entertainment, entertainment value. And it looks like we've got three new ads to watch, or videos to watch. Yeah, we got the Wedgie Berg. Yeah, we've got Tweed Anniversary, Tweed Meatball, and Tweed Veggie Berg. Okay, I've seen the anniversary one, so why don't you go through that? Happy Intersolar Kindred Day! With so many happy explorers rummaging around in outer space, we thought it would be nice to remind you that Kindred Aerospace is now 25 years old! While our business has evolved, our values have not. We are still dedicated to the preservation and promotion of humanity throughout the universe. Earth is lovely, 
But we must continue to spread if we are to survive any of a multitude of catastrophes that could befall us. If we can only continue to find new planets, we can continue to grow, unhindered by concepts of finality or scarcity. The Earth is finite. The universe is infinite. Which is why it's not only a party for Kindred, it's a party for you! Let's get spaced out together! <laughs> Alright, tweed meatball? Yes, the meatball. Three, two, one, go. No, I know! I know, it was just that it was supposed to be uninhabited! Yeah, and the size of it! <laughs> so big! Covered in what? Oh, ooh, oh, really? Oh, that can't be true. Check it all again. Yeah. Oh Jesus. I, I, I gotta go. <laughs> Damn. You nearly gave me a heart attack. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. Because now I can update you on some new discoveries regarding your planet. We found something down there. At the base of the tower. Oh, it's big. I mean, it's huge. And it's alive. It looks kind of like a... Like a building-sized death eater. <laughs> I mean, who knows what it is or... What horrors it contains. But who doesn't love meatballs? Uh. I'm sure that you're more than up to the task. So far, you overcome everything. No matter how weird or disgusting it is, just find a way to get power back into the tower. Get inside. Don't let that giant meatball eat you. Please. The giant meatball? What do you think that is? I I don't know. I'm assuming the the death meatball is the last boss. We'll see. An organism. Okay, so and... add veggie burg. Three, two, one, go. I want a veggie burger. Veggie burger. Oh. Remember me? You said I'd never be back. Well, guess who's back? Wedgie Burger's back open. Health violation's no longer a problem. They tried to shut me down. They couldn't take me out. They <laughs> wanted me to shut up. You can't stop the wedge. Wedgie Burger, come down. Get some potato wedges. Bring the kids. Kids want the wedge made of. Mom eat it for free, okay? It's five delicious vegan patties between two homemade buns. Boil twice so it's extra chewy with ketchup, cheese, and fun. It's delicious. The new five patty vegan boil burger is fun for the whole family. <laughs> Made with 100% stuck up free range vegan. Burgers may cause irritable bowel, blindness, <gasps> itchy ears, tongue warts, involuntary liver convulsions, loss of appetite. Wedgie Burger is not responsible for any medical problems arising from digestive system failure. <laughs> what are you looking at, you sick, you sick perv? Wedgie Burger. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> so they're made of vegetarians? Yep, no vegans. Vegan, specifically. <laughs> well, I'm not hungry anymore. <laughs> also, could you imagine, I don't know if maybe he was the guy that was working on the show for them, but could you imagine the, like, actor's ad for that? Must have shoulder hair. Oh, uh, these are all developers. Oh, really? Like every, <laughs> every single person we see in an FMV is on the dev team, I believe. I, if yeah, I remember right, like they hair. said, like I've it, never was, seen before. When I was talking to the developer uh, as part of the demo, he's like, "Yeah, you know, some of our favorite stuff was just these dumb ads that we made because we had nothing better to do for a while." And I was just like, "That sounds kind of amazing, actually." Mm hmm. All right. Well, uh, fun. So I was thinking we go back to the previous zone and get the um get the little objectives done so we can uh, get the sure. explorer upgrade 
Uh, so if you press J, you can open up the or Q maybe. Uh, we've no, got to do here. science experiments. So. Uh, Dude, to get index journal, so journal. Uh, specifically, yeah, primary... you want journal. We have ground and pound. Keep exploring while the cartographers keep searching. Oh, the reward stock booster. Mm -hmm. Hmm. And then we have static panic. Yeah, so that's those are the last abilities that we probably need: the ground pound and the electrical yep. shock. Yeah, but. Uh... Specifically, if you scroll down to sci science experiments, we've got to kill Gather four stuck creatures samples. in three seconds. Um, yeah, live sa samples from a jelly waft and a puffer bird. Hmm. Uh, the infected puffer bird. We've got to hit two creatures with a dying prime jelly waft waft's acid. Four stuck stuck creatures in three seconds, and three amber puffer birds with a bomber granite. Uh, we've only found two of the ten alien tablets. Oh, one's at the landing site, actually. One's in the yeah. itching field, and then three is in the elevated realm. Yeah. So a Round number of these trip. we'll go back for. I, I would say I want to do the science exper experiments because those unlock new things for us. Uh, and the global things we can come back for once we have all the abilities. Oh, but so. we have stuff at the landing site. Yeah, mm -hmm. later, though. What? Okay. What's going on? You canceled teleportation. Possibly just by pressing escape. Ah, uh, yeah, probably. So, you want to pick one of those science experiments to work on? Maybe get uh, four creatures stuck and kill them in three seconds? How do we get them stuck in the first place? We have a thing that actually, like, sticks stuff in place. Whoops. Okay. I'm going to go find the... Well, an I'm easy way to do that the... would be to bring four puffer birds into one spot with the goo. Yeah. So I'm going to task you with that one. I'm going to go see if I can find and kill a jelly waft. Oh, there it is. I need to find a... I think this spot might have enough puffer birds. So what am I supposed to kill them with? One of the bombs? N n they have to be stuck, and you just have to kill four things in three seconds. There's a separate one where we have to kill the amber... Um... Unfortunately, I'm only seeing three puffer birds on this particular island. That is unfortunate. Do you have an area with more? Uh, this might have four, four puffer birds. So yeah, the other thing you can do is if you can find enough amber, um, amber puffer birds, gather them together, you can kill them as well. Yeah, these are only normal puffer birds. Yeah. So if you got four of those, cool, but if you don't... I think the ones with the most amber puffer birds would probably be... Uh, in... Maybe it was in that one room? Or definitely yeah, I don't where really the remember. are situated. Okay, there might be four puffer birds around here. But yeah, if we can do this, we get quad jump. Okay, I found three. Damn it. Is there a four? Ah, they're farting. Oh, hey! Oh, you already unleashed this. I suppose we've fed a puffer bird to the one creature. Yep. Yeah, there are only three puffer birds here. Oh, God. Rat. Maybe in the main cavern there would be. Oh, definitely. You know? Yeah. I don't like this place. I don't want to be here anymore. 
Why did you choose this location of all the locations to try to do these experiments? Uh, because we have to be we have to be on this biome. Right, but a biome is immense. Well, yeah, go wherever. Okay. Like you, you don't have to be here with me. I'm I'm just wandering around. Uh, trying to kill the the jelly thing, which turned out to be really hard. You see, oh, over hit here two we creatures. have tons of the amber stuff. Yeah. So yeah, that's... okay. So I want to get four of these guys together. So uh, is that yeah. Is? Yeah, four guys together. So probably want to use Grob. I am using Grob. Yeah, use Grob and then just kill all of them while they're st while they're stuck. Cause you have to make sure they're stuck. Oh, by the way. I ran out of Grob. Oh, uh, you can you can get Grob back from the uh, from the ship. Yeah, it doesn't There's keep also... them very long. Yeah, there's also uh, grab canisters here and there, but that's that's hard to work with. Oh no, another ad. We'll play this next time. Okay, now I have five of the baits. That's much better. So we have to do this stuff in the festering chasm? Uh, we just have to do this stuff anywhere. So okay. it, it, so what it straight up doesn't matter. I need to get four of the ambers together and I'm supposed to destroy no. them with the acid, right? Uh, okay, please check the journal shell. Okay, okay. Because it, it straight up tells you what you have to do. Oh, no, 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 I, I don't want to waste that bomb. Oh. Uh, uh. Great. Great. have a boomerang after me. Alright. Uh. Alright, so how do I check the journal again? Is it escape? No, not that. No, 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 I didn't need to throw the grab. Gosh. Damn it. Um, okay. <laughs> We're not doing very well. So we have no. killed th three amber puffer birds with a bomb of granite. Yep. You gotta but... take off their amber first, though. Okay. No, that's understandable. So, but if I take it off them, won't they attack me? Yeah. So, my recommendation would be piss off three amber puffer birds, and then uh, just chuck a bomber granite at your feet. Super easy. Mm-hmm. But I need to get three together, because currently they're in groups of two. I think I can get a grob place just so. Did I, did I get three? Yes, I got three. Okay, and then I do this, and then I do this. Did I get it? Wander? Uh, yeah, you did. Science. I got it. Damn it. What? Oh, I was trying to get the uh, four kill. But only three mm -hmm. of them went for the grob, and only had one grob. So, I tried slapping them, but I slapped so hard, they flew off the island. So I gotta try again later. Ah, uh, okay. Freaking puffer birds. Okay. Yeah, you absolutely got that one. Um, mm -hmm. 
I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep working on the jelly things. Uh, actually, no. I'm gonna go scan the infected puffer bird real quick, cause that's that's easy. And that's one of the objectives we need to do. Oh, then I need to go refill. I gotta figure out where Rob is around here. Okay, so it's M. All right, so it's more science experience. Experiments, blah, blah, blah. So you're gonna get live samples? Yep, just did. Uh, I am. Corrosive experiment. Hit two creatures with the acid burst from a single dying prime jelly waft. The yes. prime jelly wafts are the red ones. Are the pink. Yeah. Yeah, the red pink ones. Yeah, I've been trying to do that one, but it's hard. Because you have to have enough things in vicinity to actually hit it. Well, there are a couple areas where they hover over that they do have puffer birds beneath. So if you can draw the puffer birds to one spot and hit the, the creature right over their heads, then that would be great. Yeah. Kill four creatures while they're stuck in the binding file within three seconds. Yeah. I mean, that should no. be easy to do. Oh. But what's the binding file? Is that I... the, the bouncy stuff? No, shut no, up. No. no, it's this pink stuff I have in my hand. Yeah. Isn't that the binding file? Probably, yeah. So I have to kill four creatures while they're in the binding vial. Yep. So my recommendation would be to grobler them together. Yeah. And then uh, binding bile. Now, would killing one of these creatures count as four? Uh, you mean like all the same creature? No, the screamer. Oh, um, I think they split, so... But you'd if have they to. Split, would they be caught they in the binding file? Maybe, yeah. That 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 could work actually really well. That's an experiment that I'm going to attempt. Oh come on! It's stuck. Oh, but then they get released from the binding vial when they leave. So I can't do that. It was worth a shot, though. Hmm? Yep. It was clever. If it works, that would have been awesome. Yeah, because then they would have split into four, and then I could have just kept shooting if they all remained stuck. But no, they split apart, and then they... Yep. That won't work. Oh, hey, now that we have the acid ability, I can... Oh, did you already melt all the amber down here? Yeah, then how I do we did. open this up? The alloy. I am honestly not sure. I remember there was something about putting the nuts in the holes. Unless. Hmm? Oh, maybe we put on them under the holes that with light? Yeah. Let's put the nuts under the light holes. That makes sense. Alternatively, cover the gas vents. Yeah, I mean, I had done that the last time and nothing happened. So I assumed but we it didn't, was... But... I didn't have all the gas holes because of the amber. But I thought the amber was on the light. No. No, there's only like one or two that are on the light. Well, let's, let's try one then the other. Well, I was... Yeah. It makes sense to put them on the gas holes, because that's what I was attempting to do before. Wait, what? Uh, Something happened. Oh, connection has been, been lost. Okay. Well, that might actually just be a good sign to stop. I know we were, like, in the okay. middle of that, but it reset the whole thing. And, yeah, I've been streaming for 12 and a half hours, so I'm pretty tired. 